hello students today we are going to touch chemistry word so in this we will learn 1 to 20 atomic numbers and their atomic masses and their electronic configurations but before switch on to our topic you must know what exactly atomic number and atomic mass is so atomic number which is represented by z and atomic mass is represented by a so atomic number is what it is number of protons present in an atom although in an atom number of proton is equal to number of electrons but why we will take number of proton in an atom as a definition it is because the number of electrons can be increased or decreased but since proton is present in the nucleus so its number will remain constant it will never increase or decrease now we will switch on to atomic mass you know that atomic mass is represented by symbol a and it is defined as number of proton plus number of neutrons so both of these are present in nucleus okay so let's start here so here it is atomic numbers 1 to 20 okay so these are the elements name right from hydrogen helium lithium beryllium up to calcium so first of all we will learn 1 to 20 atomic number first of all we will see 1 to 10 so here it is hey hello listen bbc news of friday night this thing you have to learn simple it is hey hello listen bbc news of friday night so he represent hydrogen hello is helium lithium listen be beryllium is boron then next b is beryllium followed by boron bb and c is carbon and nitrogen news then of oxygen friday fluorine night neon so this one is first 10 so after that we will come to 11 to 20 so 11th one is na n a na na is sodium then m a ma m magnesium a aluminium then sip 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 then si means silicon p means phosphorus then s solar is sulfur c satra for chlorine a atra argon finally last one is calcium and second last is potassium this thing you have to remember it now how to remember atomic mass let's see first of all start from 3 mark 3 stars at 3 4 and 5 now leave 3 spaces and then you have to mark star alternatively that means 9 11 13 15 17 19 now students you are seeing yellow cells without star mark what you have to do you have to simply double it that means 6 12 7 14 so on one is the exception that means the atomic number and atomic mass of hydrogen is same that is one now move to green cells which are marked with the star now simply you what you have to do you have to double it and add one that means if it is 3 then double of 3 is 6 plus 1 7 and similarly 4 double of 4 is 8 plus 1 9 simply you have to remember like this now there is an exception the atomic number 17 chlorine instead of 35 
its atomic mass is 35.5 this thing you have to remember similarly atomic number 18 is organ and its atomic number atomic mass is 40 instead of 36 so this thing you have to remember it okay now we will see electronic configuration so electronic configuration is the arrangement of electrons in their respective shells atomic number of hydrogen is one so it will be accommodated in shell number one and atomic number of helium is two which is also accommodated in first shell as first shell can accommodate maximum up to two electrons so lithium has three electrons or atomic number three so it will accommodate two one that means in first shell it is there is a two electrons and in the second shell it is one electron so it's keep on going like this that means two 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 three two four two five two six two seven and two eight so second shell in second shell maximum eight electrons can be accommodated that means for sodium atomic number 11 so electronic configuration is 281 that means in first shell maximum two electrons in second shell maximum eight electrons and one electron will be moved to next shell that means shell number three and similarly 282 283 and it will keep on going like this and at organ that means atomic number 18 288 once again this one is completely filled so for potassium atomic number 19 electronic configuration is 2881 and electronic configuration of calcium atomic number 20 is 2882 so the elements with the red mark they are noble gases that means their outermost shell is completely filled so they never react with any other element now students we will move to the last column which is valency now what is valency valency of an element is a measure of its combining power with uh, with other atoms when it forms chemical compounds or molecules so for metals it is equal to number of electrons in the outermost shell of their atom outermost shell of lithium has one electron so its valency is one similarly beryllium plus two boron plus three sodium plus one magnesium plus two aluminium plus three potassium plus one calcium plus two lycon valency of non-metal is eight minus number of electrons present in the outermost shell for example the outermost shell of oxygen has six electrons so its valency is eight minus six that comes to be minus two similarly outermost shell of chlorine has seven electrons so its valency is eight minus seven that means minus one so students all elements having valency plus one plus two and plus three are metals rest of all are non-metals this thing you have to remember it so students in next video i will tell you how to learn cations and anions till then goodbye